Hello guys, Super Mario LFC and today I wanna give you a first impression about the new classified Firecrest set and I will show you if it's good in PvP or in PvE. First of all I wanna say the Firecrest set needs fire immunity for the player because each time you're killing an NPC he's the Firecrest sets him on fire and you're still burning the whole time and can't shoot other NPCs. You see here in the showcase and after on I will show you some Firecrest gameplay in the underground that you'll see how if it's good in PvE. So let's see if it's good in PvP against players. Is the Firecrest turret dealing a lot of damage to players? And I think no. He he's able to chill in my turret and if he takes a med kit if he stands in my fire, he's able to destroy my turret almost instantly and yeah, he's not even use a EMP sticker or something else to counter it. So I would not recommend it in PvP because it's it's not good enough for PvP or maybe for ground control but nothing else. So now I will show you my build I'm using for my PvE setup. In PvE it's it's more powerful than in PvP but it's it's annoying to get on fire the whole time if you're using not an immunizer or a teammate is not using an immunizer. So let's go. My knee pads are on electronic, health on it. It's just a PvE setup with damage to elites everywhere. My holster is with skill bar on electronic, disrupt resistance because of the PvP side of this game. Stamina mod with skill haste and turret damage for sure. My class LMG damage, skill haste and m and armor damage. Because normally you got a, a tactician on your side with a good pull so you don't need crit chance or crit damage. My holds again, turret damage. I'm using the M4 here, self preserved, intense, and deep the mine. I'm searching for a firecrest cloth with assault rifle damage, but I'm not able to get it. And yeah, here my MG5 deep the mine, but I'm my primary weapon is my M4 because of the enemy armor damage I'm dealing with this setup to the NPCs. So let's go to my skills. My, I'm healing myself with 144. My turret is dealing 14k damage without any buff. And the most important one is here the health. The health is too low at the Firecrest turret. They need to increase the health, especially in PvP. But like you see before, it's easy to destroy for a damage dealer and Everybody is using Striker or Nomad and the tankiness or Predator, 9k or a lot of life, so we need more Firecrest damage and health. I can't believe I would say that <laughs> a couple months ago, but yeah, Firecrest need a buff. Yeah, my skill power is at 274, just um, normal, my toughness 407. I prefer to take more toughness because otherwise I'm pretty pretty squishy and I don't want that. My skill list is 34. You are able to change the damage to elite mods to skill haste so you're able to get up to 40% skill haste but it's on you. It's just a recommended build for PvE because in PvE it's pretty funny and especially if you got the immunizer on your side and you're not doing the missions alone. So then you are not the whole time on fire because of the NPCs and it's a lot of fun to play and something else like the normal builds like Strike or Nomad or the Tactician. It's the Firecrest turret and yeah, you're dealing more damage to burning targets so it's a pretty good uh, solo set I think because of the ground control and you're dealing more damage and you set up the 
enemy is on fire. 2% of each bullet has a chance to set the enemy on fire. So that's pretty good. And the 6 piece also grants you that the opponent gets an explosion with fire. So, what is your opinion about the fire crest? Do you think also it needs a buff or especially fire immunity because everything is on fire the whole time? Let me know in my comment section below. Yeah, I would appreciate uh, a like and a follow as well. So, yeah, that was my video. Have a nice day guys. See you and have fun with the gameplay in the underground. See ya.
things just showed up down in the tunnels. If it checks out, we've got us a golden opportunity here.